Well, there's the new paint. Now I haven't wet sanded anything. I just put a coat of primer over it and I shot this paint. It's not bad. I mean it is real close to the right color. I think it's a little bit lighter but as it dries maybe it'll darken up and it's, it seems to be doing that but um, as you can see I've got like overspray from about here over so I'm going to uh, wet sand all this off and I'll wet sand the whole thing and uh, we'll take a look at it see how it goes I, I also thought of an option if it sticks out too badly that after I get done uh, wet sanding all this is to just to get take a width and start from like from here from the edge and then just kind of go up and uh, over like this back down to this edge and then either just go go back down to the corner or just do that whole paint that whole bottom but look at that, I just skinned it. Rats. But anyway, it's an option. So we'll see how it works. But it's it's it actually is blending a whole lot better than that paint that was supposed to be the same color. Like I said, it, it that other paint might have been the right paint, but I guess you know I just didn't apply it properly but um, anyway yeah and then I don't know like I said I don't understand paint but I primered this side I had it all nice and primered I used this and you know it says it's automobile primer well I, I again I had it all sanded and then I took uh, some, what is it called, mineral spirits, wiped over the top of it, clean all the dust off and, you know, any kind of oils, which shouldn't have been any oils anyway, sprayed it with that Rust-Oleum primer, and it all um, crow feeded on me. Just all, you know, just separated, and, and then I hit it with some... Um, this dupa color primer, this, this filler primer, and uh, well, it stuck. It didn't uh, crow's feed on me, or chicken feed, or whatever you want to call it. But um, it's, it's, you know, you can still see the uh, where it's, it's crow feeded at. So it's got to be all sanded off. But it's wet now, so I gotta wait until tomorrow. I don't know, it's like, geez whiz, just something small like this is taking me days to do, you know, so it's just frustrating. But anyway, I'll get back with you after I get to the other side, wet sand, and we'll see how she looks. So, thanks for watching.